My name is Michael, and today we are going to learn speaking through grammar. What if I tell you after today's lesson, you will be able to handle 80% of daily speaking with correct grammar? It's going to happen to you. And today we will look at some very short material and do some speaking. But first, please group yourself into two groups of four and a group of three. We are intermediate teenagers. Okay, come on, buddy. Well, I forgot to do here. Let's do that. You're okay. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, I'm come over here. Oh, sorry. Uh, as you all are at intermediate level, I want you to take a look at this handout, just part A, for three minutes, and match group one with two and three. The three word highlighters with stars are prepositions of place which is useful for the speaking activity later, but you don't have to use it now. Feel free to raise your hand at any time, and there will be a Q&A session at the end of the Good. Okay. Good. Uh, um, I would like to know how is it different from how 
how you approach grammar. How is it different from this method? If this is a root, it's just um, if you see here, and then you will, you will instantly think of has. You don't have to think of any other process, but is it any different from how you guys uh, approach grammar? No. 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 They are, those are in past tense form. And how would you match them to? This one? I would you match with which one? Uh, I, I, I have all of them. Oh, okay. And how about this two? I she was, he was, she was, she was. She was.
and looked at Nadia's test. <laughs> <laughs>
Or you can permanently on the whiteboard the organization of your whiteboard day and date and weather, uh, the roadmap, what are we doing today, little helpers on the right, and then one block is always grammar, middle, anything, and on the right always vocabulary. So you can have your permanent IDCE or uh, magnet with the poster, yes. So you have to identify problems for yourself. Mine is right here. I cannot write neat. So I don't just say, well, I write ugly. I find a solution. I also cannot draw. So I found a, I think it's just continue, but Google had, you start drawing something like a snake, and on the bottom, they <laughs> immediately give you suggestions. And you just click on the snake. Things like that. I think most teachers can't draw. Yeah. <laughs> If you can draw and play a musical instrument, oh man, the schools love you, the kids love you. <laughs> so, but then the kids also love you because they, they see you are human. You're drawing a snake, wow, that's not a snake, it's a donut teacher. <laughs> so, uh, you get them speaking right from the start, that's good, because it sets the tone for a speaking lesson. I would say instead of telling them, make your own groups, assign them to groups. So I use an online, you can search it, group generator. You type in their names and the wheel spins and then immediately they are in groups. Or you can use popsicle sticks with different colors. What else can you use to assign groups? Apps. There's a, yeah, a lot of apps out there. Um, so yes, make a poster or PowerPoint before class. Instructions need to be more clear, you need to be more firm. In the beginning, I was the same. Say, oh, okay, you, you guys do what you want, but you have to be more firm, okay, to let them know you are in charge. Color coding you used at one point, good. Uh, the grammar might mean for the intermediates, yes, they repeated, they practiced. Students were engaged in the discussions. I would add more visuals, pictures or timelines for grammar, so they, they have that visual reference. So in the end, plan your lesson content, you did that, but then you have to follow the lesson plan, otherwise you end too early, and then there's time left. So follow your lesson, you can always look while you are teaching, no problem. And for everybody, including me, always have a backup plan, plan B. Class of intermediates, Three minutes, you already finished speaking at two minutes. Shows me it's a high level class, so this lesson is going to finish early. Have something prepared as a backup. Hey, thank you, Michael.